Uh, my name is Jim Howard. Today's date, it's July 12th of 2017. This is a review of a butane torch. And this is it. Pretty neat. It's the first one I've actually had. Yes, I'm 70-something years old. This is, I guess, one reason I don't smoke. <sighs> well, don't barbecue either. I really got this for several reasons. I liked the looks of it, but also been watching some uh, movies about cooking. Uh, not cooking movies on how to cook, but uh, movies. And the person in the movie has been a, a cook. I think Chinese in one movie and some others. For some reason, I've kind of got interested in, I like it to see them preparing the food and everything. And I noticed that they use a butane torch. And, you know, they're, they're professional chefs and they have large kitchens. They have people working for them. And they're using a torch and so I thought well I'd like to kind of try something like that just for the heck of it but then I also thought that I could uh, use this for a little electrical work that I do for shrinking the uh, when you put some wires together you put uh, shrinking plastic over it and then you can heat that and make a good seal and uh, for some other reasons. And so I ordered this. And this is pretty neat. And like I said, I uh, didn't really know anything about them. I don't think I've ever used anything. I mean, I've, uh, I was a welder for 10 years using, we didn't use butane though, uh, arc welder, so we used electricity. But I had a settling cutting. I had settling welding outfit at home and we used them at work and what have you but uh, I'm not really familiar with butane uh, devices you know people have uh, cigarette lighters that they put butane in and use those for lighting cigarettes I've never smoked but this is pretty neat and I was thinking well I don't smoke I'm going to have to get some matches around here or whatever. And then I discovered, I, when I was looking at the, I haven't, I haven't actually read the instructions yet, but, uh, well, I guess I did. They're on the back here. But uh, I looked at a little diagram, and it says, I can't read it now. I need a little more light for that. I turned the light down a little bit to uh, sit. I forget, I think, acting activator or uh, I thought, wait a minute this has so has a button here for the volume of the butane you're going to use I'm going to turn that on I've turned it on now and then you hit the lighter oh, no you don't you have to turn it up more and this is adjustable we can go with it. Okay, I'm gonna turn it off. I thought that is pretty neat. Does not come with a butane. Uh, I can understand that you have to purchase that separate the tank. Uh, you know butane shipping butane through you can't ship it through the mail I don't think. It has to be by truck or something like that. So, uh, but my son, my grown son, does smoke, and he, I said I was going to have to go down to Walgreens and purchase a little oh, thing of butane. I think they cost like six, varying prices, I think it's like six bucks for, uh, you can order on Amazon though, but uh, he had a thing of butane here, and so we, or he, 
filled it with the port on the bottom there. Hang on, don't touch the mouse, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I had to check which camera I was using. Uh, a culinary torch. A butane torch, refillable. As I said, butane does not come with it. You have to purchase that. Professional grade. Feels quality. And I like the adjustment for the flame and the starter there where you just hit the button and you start it up. This is the package that it comes in. And the instructions are are there. I'm not going to go over this because this is on Amazon. You know, you can read this. Um, and I will show you the views that they have of it because that picnics, kitchen, model processing. Oops. Cake surface. Grilling food surface. You know, I like uh, toasted cheese sandwiches. You know, uh, very easy to make, just throw it on a skillet. But I wonder. Maybe this would be the better way to do it. I don't know. This is making me hungry. Looking at this. That's gross looking, whatever that is. Not sure what that is. I, I'm sorry I looked at it. <laughs> Fixing pipes. Other stuff like that. I may use it for ham radio, like I said, uh, wires. Am I out of the shrink tubing? I don't remember. Let's see, simple operation. Uh, amazing uses. Safe guarantee. 100% lifetime guarantee. I do recommend it. Like I said, it appears to be well made. It appears to be, a, you know, for the price, it's a quality product, and I do recommend it. I thank you very much for watching.